you guys were a part of a very cool uh, fundraiser, uh, Katy Perry's pickleball tournament for camp fireworks. Yeah. It's like camp firework, the firework, firework foundation. Firework foundation. foundation. Yeah. Hashtag firework foundation. Very cool event. Um, and you guys were on the same team in a little pickleball tournament. Uh, how'd that go? Fuck you, Ryan. We were we were a little we were a little pickly. We were the towards worst each other. ones. But you know what? Can I can I go first? Can I go no. first? Yeah. Fine. I've okay, been I'm waiting go for this all week. Let's go first because we almost got in a marriage fight. I want to go first just by starting with an apology. Oh, and I love smart you. That move. sounds right. No, yeah. no, I love you. I, um, I love you. I for what? For being very insecure. Yes. I was very insecure. Yes. Uh, it was. An event with a lot of really cool people. Very cool people. And I learned a lot about myself that day. Yeah, me too. And yes, you did. But I did things in an incorrect way. And mm-hmm. I learned how to how to be Is that better. What your therapist said? Uh well, no, that's what you and I said at the end right. of the night. <laughs> that's what we said. I was explaining to my therapist what had happened. Just yes. making sure and he validated a lot of the yes. things I said. Um, but yeah, I, I I came up to you at the beginning of the event and was like, hey, can you re- remember me? Okay, I saw Jeff Bezos' fiance or wife to be or wife. I'm not sure if they're married yet. Uh, Lauren, and I've never met her before, but I was told that I was gonna play her at some point. So uh, we we're all chit chatting, like signing in, you know, getting our name tags. And I looked over and I was like, oh. She seems very confident. I should just go like. I was like, yeah, we gotta go say we hi. Gotta, she she was. You said let's go say it's hi. That's what I do. I like to I like did. to float around. So I, I went do. over. I she, did my bar. I said yeah. hi. I have to play you today. Nice to meet you. And then I get a little tap on my shoulder, and it's you. And I was like, oh, this is my husband. And then me not thinking anything was wrong, I get pulled aside. I get pulled aside by my husband, who in a little kid toddler way was like, hey. Can you remember me sometimes? Because it hurts my feelings when you just go meet people and don't bring me with you. And I was like, it is nine in the morning and you're <laughs> yelling at me for something I don't think I did wrong. But let's talk about it. I was like, what, do I have to hold you like a leash? So for the rest of the day, I held on to you. Um, or well, the away. nice thing about oh. that is Daryl is just still that he's still that little kid, kid, which is nice because it could be worse. He could be annoying as fuck and he's not. He's but not. you are I'll you are at, you are at there's a status with you now, Daryl. You are Daryl Sabara, Megan Turner's husband. You, hey, what's going on? I'm her husband, Daryl Sabara. How, how you doing? Yeah, what's dude. I, I just go. Hi, Megan Turner's brother. I said Ryan, Ryan walked right up. Said, yeah, I I'm, went, I'm also here. Natu- naturally. But yeah. but well, he I'm, realizes because he's insecure. Well, yeah. I'm going to take you through the thought process. Yeah, give me, give, me, give me the rundown. Is that in that story, Megan's like, I was going to play, you know, Lauren. I was also going to play Lauren because I was a part of your team. So it was it was the like, hey. But like, it's about me, Daryl. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> some t- it is. It is. Uh, and that's why that's why I said what I said, but I said it in, in the wrong way. Yeah, it was and, like I was in trouble. And I was like, well, how am and, I in trouble? And I am sorry for that. Thank you. I'm sorry. Um, don't be sorry. You did nothing wrong. And that was the whole thing is like, I talked to you in a way that you did do something wrong. Yeah, I was because, like, damn, I Because of my insecurity, I put, like, I projected onto you and I put blame on you. And even though I wasn't like, I blame you, you did this. I, it's still like my tone was that way. Right. And that was I the start of our in, day. I know. Right. I know. And we had to go game face. We had to like, I know. Game game. I know. Well, so we'll we get start- into that. Wait, hold on. We'll get into that. I just want to say, I realize now I'm, insecure okay. in those moments Thank and you. that was huge just to realize that so now i know if i have that feeling again i go oh i'm just being insecure right now let's let's not follow ryan let's not <laughs> yeah follow ryan follow ryan um <laughs> shake and bake baby fake it till you make it you <laughs> yeah. know yeah but anyway, I'm sorry, and I love you, I love and you. thanks for helping me through that. You have to remember how cool you are, too. Yeah, well, yeah, I well, because, you know, you, you got to understand in his head is like, well, I'm here because my wife, you know, pop star is the pop star event, so yes. I don't want to, you don't want to do too much. But so he, so he's like, why what? we got there? Because your friend invited you. I know. That's the only reason why we were there, baby, because of you. Oh, I didn't even know that. That's why she was like, I've known yeah, Daryl since he was like dude. nine. Yeah. She was like, you were the guy. Was, you were the guy. He's like, even I was more just, of a reason why you should have brought me over, bitch. Oh, so, I was just, I was, <laughs> so then we started anyway. Rocky. So then we get there. We're very insecure. We're like terrified to play. Yeah. We start. We did a warm up with this um, this couple. Great warm up sesh, though. You guys were really well, on fire. It, it was too much. We we were really good in the warm up. 
So we were too good we in the warm up. We were too good in the warm up. Yep. We were on fire. Yep. And to the point where we were sweating. And Katie walked over and was like, <laughs> "Save it for the the actual challenge." And then the, you drink a Celsius. Okay, yeah. Well, okay, was... wait, hold on. Then I saw Rob Lowe drink a Celsius, and I was like, man, Rob Lowe is so cool. He's having a Celsius. I will also have a Celsius. Katie okay. was yelling at you to have one, too. She's yeah. like, Megan, you're going to be exhausted one. to have a Celsius. Saying, That's what I need right now? Yeah. No. No. And, uh, yeah, and I had a Celsius, and then all my energy just depleted. And then it was the first time I'd ever played pickleball in front of people. A lot of people watching. A lot, a, of, a lot of important to people fair, watching. We a crowd, and we brought most of the people. It was mom, dad. Dude. Our friends Amanda Jam, you. Yeah. There's a lot of handfuls. There was only like 12 chairs. There was a decent amount. There was like 25 people watching. Okay. I looked once and then went, oh, I'm never going to look over there again. I loved it. I looked at you guys every time. I was like, help me. Because <laughs> I lost a lot of points. But first game, tough game. It was 0-15. Uh, yes. We had zero. Yes. And I didn't appreciate it, but the sweet scoring lady said, what? When I said zero, he was like upset. And I was like, we don't belong here. I just kept going. I write songs. Zero points is Zero tough. Zero points is And that's really the first tough. game. It's going to really. The first game. That's hit the it. tone. It hits you. And, yeah. and like, sweet Daryl was so in his head. You could look at him and be like, wow, that person's in their head. The and Celsius, dude. I, I know. It missed, backfired. Missed so many hits that you would never miss at home. You I know? know. I'm like, you would never do but that. Celsius also, is great like, on certain occasions. Like the Tate McRae concert, rips. Yeah, Celsius I'm never is doing Celsius at, in the morning ever again. I think it's I'm tough do to do before a workout. I've had trouble doing a workout after a celsius sometimes like focusing yeah it's yeah. you're very no it was like weird. scatterbrained yeah yeah and then we played um jeff bezos wifey lauren and um her amazing awesome friend i can't remember her name because i'm terrible with names but elsa so cute. Uh, oh yeah elsa because it was like the princess right something like that that was her name and they were just like literally teaching us how to play. They're like, "Okay, it's your serve now." And then I was like, "And oh, you, you step up to yeah, the net." Yeah, yeah. Okay. I was like, "Thank you." I don't know. That what game I'm was doing. fun. That and, game was fun. And we got points. We got six points on that game. So there you go. Three. Yep. Then we. Played, I, I and... just, from the perspective of of me sitting in the crowd watching, I just saw Daryl like a lot of the times in Megan's. He's a ball area. Hog. He's a ball hog. I tried my best to get out. He wanted fair. to hit every ball. He doesn't trust me, and it's fair. And he goes, "Don't worry, babe, I got so it." So then, when he goes to your side, they just hit it to his because it was wide open. Yes. Yeah, yeah. I, don't worry, I was there too, don't and worry. I I noticed that as well. Because then we played Katy Perry's mom and Charlie Puth's mom. <laughs> Deb, you. love you, Deb. Deb and Mary, sweet, sweet ladies, and they. Also destroyed us. Obliterated. And no, no. Fucking, they obliterated us. Really? I do. I couldn't. I didn't pay attention. Oh, to the score. Deb just kept hitting it underneath Charlie my legs Poo's the entire mom. time. That's how you win in pickleball. Slamming Hit it, low. it, slamming it to his legs. And she goes, hey, "Open them up a little bit more. Let me go right through." And I was like, "She's taunting you, bro." <laughs> Nightmare. And then one time he hit it so out of like out of the park, and I go to the moon. Like by that point we were done. We were done. 